Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be making some braised short rib sandwiches. Let's go ahead and get started by dicing up these vegetables. Bunch of kosher salt. Oh yeah, that's the sear we want. We want that all the way around. This was not recording the whole time up here. We got five carrots, five stalks of celery, two whole white onions. It's been deglazing the bottom of the bottom of the pot from when I had the ribs in there. And then I just added in a whole tablespoon of better than bouillon. And we're gonna let this go for about 20 minutes. Let these get softened up. Not very softened because it's all going in the oven, but we wanna get them cooked down a little bit. All right, we're gonna go in with some red wine now that these are going for about 20 minutes. About that much. We're gonna reduce this all the way down before we add in our beef stock. All right, let's go ahead and nestle our short ribs back down in here. All right, we're gonna go in with beef stock. Enough to cover them up. That's four cups. We're gonna go in with a whole bulb of garlic. We're gonna go in with sage, thyme, and rosemary. Salt. All right, we're gonna put this into a 350 degree oven for two hours. All right, it's been two and a half hours. The beets to the tenderness that I would like. I'm gonna go ahead and pull the meat out of this pot and get it ready to shred up. We're gonna take the broth that's in here, we're gonna put it in another pot and reduce that down for a dipping sauce for our sandwiches. We're gonna pour this in very carefully. That is too hot for just these gloves. I'm gonna get all the liquid out of there. All right, we're gonna get an even smaller pot. We're gonna put a mesh strainer in there and we're gonna go ahead and strain this again. And while this is simmering, we're gonna set it to the side and we're gonna shred our beef. All right, now that this is all shredded up, set it to the side. Might be one of the best things I've ever made. Wow. Make that. <laughs> 